Whoa. Am I recording? Oh yeah, I am. So, today is, the sun is so bright. Let me scoot over. What am I doing? Got him, got him, so, today is, what's today? Friday, October 16th. It is roughly around 6 o'clock. And we're going to go get ice cream. Um, I've been really craving some ice cream today, so, um, I want to go to Far's Better Ice Cream because I love their choices. Like, they have so much to choose from, but I don't know where the BF is going to take us, so. I'm just going to go get some ice cream. And I'm, like, super glad. You want to see I've been doing my eyebrows so thick lately. I feel like a chola with this shirt too. to Walmart and I just realized like my lipstick's like halfway gone so yeah I'm gonna see if I have the thing I always have wipes with me otherwise that would be so embarrassing if I can get it out so yeah I'm gonna go to Walmart um I am looking for like a just like a cheap curling wand the ones that are really really skinny um because i want like a really nice um kinky curls i don't know if that's how you call them but i'm looking for anyways i was saying so i'm looking for a curling wand just to do really like tight curls because i'm going to film tomorrow my glamorous witch um makeup tutorial which either this vlog will be up first or that makeup tutorial it's that makeup look that i posted on my instagram um where i was wearing the green purple and orange it's just halloween colors but since you guys are looking for halloween makeup looks and the only reason why i don't want to or i'm not going to be doing um like scary ones or things like that is because i don't have paint and i know that paint from like your local halloween stores suck nalgas so i'm not even gonna mess with that um maybe next year i'll prepare myself a little bit more and you know get something ready for you guys but I think I just want to stay with the whole makeup thing and still incorporate some sort of Halloween theme to it, if that makes sense. I was also thinking of doing like a candy corn makeup tutorial where it goes from like orange, yellow to white. I don't know what to do with it, but I think I want to create something similar like that. Something that if you go to a Halloween party, and you want to look cute and you know but still want to be halloween-esque you can do that so yeah that's what i'm gonna go to walmart for long story short to get a wand to curl my hair make it super big and i have this witch hat that i bought so i can film that tutorial i'm super excited i really like how the makeup look came out and tons of you were telling me for me to film it because you guys wanted to possibly wear that so if you guys do end up wearing it let me know and you know 
tag me on Instagram or send me DMs. I always read them so I can post your pictures. Now I'm not wearing my seatbelts. I am so horrible. It's such a bad habit. I'm by myself and I suck at putting my seatbelt on. So I just left Walmart. I always say that I'm going to vlog like when I'm shopping, but I get so embarrassed. Like, I don't know, like people here from Utah, like, I don't know, they're weird. They look, they don't look actually, they stare. And I don't know, I just, I get embarrassed. You know, like I don't like people, I don't like being the center of attention. I don't like people looking at me. So, <laughs> It's always hard for me to vlog in stores, especially when I'm alone because then people will really look at me and say like, you know, like, esta loca que trae. So I just, I usually don't do it. But I was able to find the wand that I wanted. Um, it's just, I think it's a 3 4 inch wand. I don't know if, if, if it's the one that I was looking for. But that's the one that I just got. It was super cheap and like always, I'm gonna keep my receipt because if I don't like it, I'm gonna return it. You better know that. So yeah, I'm just gonna go home and relax. Probably watch some YouTube videos and we'll see what else we can do. Tomorrow, I'm probably gonna film. I usually don't like to film on weekends because I try to spend those days with my fam. Dude, seriously? This guy like just cut me off. Anyway, so usually on the weekends, I like to just spend them with my boyfriend and my daughter. Sometimes we'll hang out with friends. Um, or sometimes we'll go over to my sister's house, which you guys have yet to meet. She's kind of uh, camera shy, so that's why I haven't, you know, gotten her in in camera because she's just she's not a camera person. But ho hopefully I can get her soon. I've been wanting to do the um, the sister tag for the longest time, but again, I just she's a busy woman. She does work. So it's hard for me to get her, but hopefully I can get her one of these days and we can do a sister tag so you guys can get to know her. Um, so yeah, it'll be fun. Hello world. I am off again on another adventure. So I am on my way to Rite Aid. Um, I did recently film a video doing some swatches and a review on the new Revlon Ultra HD Matte Lip Colors. If you guys haven't seen that, it'll be in the description bar. Anywho, so I'm gonna go back and return them because um, I tried to wear them again the following day um, after I filmed and I still wasn't feeling them. I really just didn't like them at all. So I am gonna go back and return them because I don't feel it's necessary for me to keep um, products that I'm not going to use that I don't like and that I don't want especially if you have a receipt <clears throat> I'm so out of breath I was like running for my life <laughs> if you have a receipt seriously return it I mean it's it's not your fault that you didn't like the makeup you know it's like that's that's the company and it is what it is you know, it's it's a loss for the company, but that's business. So, I don't know if you... I've heard that some people feel bad about returning products. I highly doubt that they've put them back on market, you know. I'm pretty sure they return it back to the company and then, you know, I don't know what happens after that. But, yeah, so I'm just going to go back and return it. And I'm actually going to stop by Target. I was going to go to Ulta but I don't feel like going to Ulta, so, which is the first. I'm just gonna go to Target, and I'm going to pick up one of the NYX um, eyeshadow base in um, the white one, because I have the NYX eyeshadow, pen or the jumbo eye pencil, but it broke off, and then 
it kind of dried out so I'm just gonna get in a little pot I like it because I can use it with a brush and apply directly onto my um, my eyelid so I'm at Target and <laughs> um I have like a full sorry I have like a full face of makeup because I was messing around with some makeup today and I just wanted to create a really fun like Halloween makeup look so yeah I have like full on eyelashes and you know the whole nine yards which I usually don't like on a daily basis I really don't wear makeup just because I don't go anywhere um but today I did and I'm like full like glam Look how horrible my skin looks. My skin looks really good when I'm filming because of the lights. But in person, I really don't have good skin. I've actually been thinking about going to a dermatologist um, and seeing what products work best with my skin. Just because I have really large pores. Look, I'll show you. Ain't no shame. I have really large pores. What? Large pores here. And then I have a whole bunch of little bumps that I don't know if I've got an, aller an allergic reaction to a certain product or what it could be. But these bumps, they don't go away. So I've been thinking of just saving up some money and going to a dermatologist and seeing, you know, what's, what products work best for my oily skin just so I can reduce the size of my pores and just really have... A really clean skin um, and I've been wanting to get rid of these little wrinkles that I have I've had these for years and I think my only option for this as far as I know would have to be injections like Juvederm or something like that which might be expensive and I'm not gonna lie I have look looked into it but I don't know if it's in my budget right now. So let me stop talking and let's go to Target. Um, I already got what I needed, that NYX eyeshadow base, um, the, the white one, and then I also got this little witch's hat because I'm going to do this okay. look that I'm having, or this look that I have, which is like green, orange, and purple, which is perfect for Halloween. Um, I'm going to film this, but I'm going to make it as like a glamorous witch obviously not this lipstick i'm gonna wear a black one and it'll look really cute and you'll be a cute witch huh. what are you gonna be for halloween you gonna be a dinosaur or a witch what are you gonna be for halloween Candy. no that's what you're gonna get what are you gonna dress up as Witch. No. I just remember. Witch. It is a hat. Yeah, it's a hat. But remember what you're dressing up as for Halloween. What? Damn. No, you're gonna dress up as Doctor McStuffins. Remember. Doctor McStuffins had wing candy. Doctor McStuffins. Yeah. She's pretty much just excited for the Halloween candy, which I am too. So I just left Target. Um, I didn't really find a lot of things. Well, not that I was looking for many. But like I said, I just got that little witch hat. Um, so I can do that um, witch 
no, wait, makeup wait. video. Um, so yeah, right now we're just gonna go to um, Sam's Club to get some jabón so I can wash my ropa. She copies everything I say. And then after that, I'm gonna go home. So I think this is going to be this is going to be the end of the vlog. I'm sorry it wasn't too fun, but I'll try to vlog a little bit more throughout the days. I mean, on a day-to-day -day basis, I cannot speak. On a day-to-day -day basis, oh my gosh. On a day-to-day -day basis, there we go. I don't do anything. I'm literally home all day with this little booger and I just watch yeah. TV. Sometimes I'll get ready and then there's those days that I film. So that's why I don't really vlog during the day. But if you guys are still interested, I'll try to do that either way. So yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and put this little booger in her car seat so nobody says that I don't buckle her in. So... Yeah, I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.